I still don't I still don't understand how this game works. You can, you can probably see. Welcome to the Foreclosure Task Force. Good morning, Sensei. A lot of people are starting to talk about shale, and we received letters from the other students asking for help. That's a great sign, and it means there is a lot of work for us to do. Um, but there's one letter we got. I think you should take a look. Read the letter. To the advisor of the Federal Investigation Club. Hello, my name is Okusora Ayana, and I'm a student at the Business High School. I'm writing this letter because I want to ask for your help. Our academy is being harassed. One of the local gangs has been tormenting us. Read the next page. It's a long story, but we think this gang is after the school building itself. The students are doing their best to stop them. It's only a matter of time before we run out of ammunition and supplies, though. At this rate, the school will fall to them for sure. Let's read the last page. That's why I'm writing to ask for your help. Can you please help us, Sensei? Okay, that seems like the, that seems like a that seems like a job for Sensei. Mm, Abyssos, Abydos High School, huh? It used to have a large, thriving district, but it fell on hard times due to climate change. Uh, really? Interesting. The district was so big that the people could would even get lost in the middle of town. He he, that must have sounded ridiculous. How does someone get lost in the middle of modern civilization? I'm sure that was just an urban legend. Uh, we will proceed to get lost. Anyway, I can't believe the academy is being bullied by some low-life gang. It sounds pretty serious. I wonder what brought this on. I need to go to Abydos. You want to head there right away? You really don't back down, do you? All right then, good luck. <coughs> I eventually arrived at the Bidos, but got lost in the middle of the district. It took days to find the school. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. First day at the Bidos. That sounds about right. <laughs> that sounds about right. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, no way we're gonna get lost in the... In the uh, no way we're gonna get lost in the uh, in the middle of a dis uh, civilization. We proceed to get lost in the middle of civilization. <laughs> the foreclosure task force was formed to prevent Abyssos from high school from closing. The school's debt persists despite the... Yeah, it's already the same thing. Okay. Yeah, sure. <laughs> First day at Abyssos. Okay, so um, I, it appears I need to be saved. It appears I need to be saved. Chirp, chirp, chirp. Mm-hmm. Huh? Screech. Hmm. Oh, hi there. Hello. <laughs> I appear it appears I am dying. Probably of hunger. Cause I got lost for days. Are you okay? Ask for help. <laughs> you didn't get mucked, did you? Or involved in some kind of accident? What's that? You fainted from hunger? So you're not homeless? Oh. <laughs> Glasses. You came here on business but faded out of hunger and dehydration when you couldn't find a single shop open? Well, that's hardly surprising. It happens all the time around here. It's been a long time since there were business open in this neighborhood that often that offer food and drinks. You would have more luck further down the outskirts. You're not sure to get there? So this must be f your first time here. Hold on. Rummaging. Here, have some of my energy drink. It's recycling, but it's all I have right now. Better than nothing. I just noticed she's a cat girl. How do I miss that she's a cat girl? <laughs> okay, Sensei got lost. Uh, sensei gets lost in the in the middle of the town. I literally do not notice the cat ears. You and I are not so different, aren't we? Uh, wait, let me get you a cup of some or something. Drink straight from the bottle. Go, go. You weren't supposed to. Never mind. Don't worry about it. Think, thank her for coming to your rescue. Um, it looks like you're an adult from the General Student Council. Are you here on some kind of academy-related business? Ours is the only one around. 
Here, he's here to visit the Abydos High School? Nod. Oh, it's been a long time since anyone visited us. Let me show you the way. It's not too far from here. What? Too hungry to move? That's a problem. <laughs> Ask for a ride. But my bike only has one seat. Ask for a piggy bag ride instead. <laughs> Fine. I'd rather do that. Let me just park my bike. Hop on. Shuffle. Wait. It's just... I've been cycling for a while. I don't didn't work up that much some sweat, but still. Usually have to take a shower at school afterwards and keep a change charge of clothes there. Huh? You don't mind? You actually think I smell good? What is anyone supposed to say to that? Mmm, <laughs> nioi. <laughs> yeah, since he's blunt, I see. I see how it is. I see how it is. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's fine. You smell good. It's all right. What is anyone supposed to say to that? Whatever. As long as you're not going to complain. Let's go. Snuff, sh snuffle, shuffle. Hold on tight. And this... I'm back. Welcome back, Shiro... -ka. Who's the tragedy on your back? Hello! Whoa! Shiroko kidnapped someone! That's... that's that or it's a dead body! What did you do, Shiroko? <laughs> Everyone calm down. We have to we have her, we have to help her hide the body. Go grab and shovel the pickaxe from the storage. <laughs> nice! No, no, I, I'm not I'm not dead yet. Collapses. Settle down. They're alive and breathing. <laughs> they just came to visit school. What? It's not a corpse. A visitor? Are you sure you didn't kidnap them? Uh greet them with a smile. Hi. I'm shocked. We hadn't had a visitor in ages. True, but uh, were we expected anyone? I'm an advisor with Shale. It's nice to meet you. Oh wait, are you? You're with Shale? The Federal Investigation Club? Wow, that means you got the letter Ayana wrote. This is great. That means we can kindly get more ammo and supplies. I have to tell Hoshino. Wait, where is she anyway? She's taking a nap in the next room. I'll, I'll go wake her up. Uh, was that gunfire? Huh? Ha ha ha! They're all out of ammo. Finish them off and take over, and then take over the school. Um. That's a group approaching the school. It must be the Katakata Helmet Gang. Those punks. They have some nerve coming back to for more. I've got Hoshino. Now, if she just wake up. Oh, just five more minutes. Hoshino, the helmet gang is attacking you again. By the way, this is Sensei from Shale. Oh, that's a problem. Oh, nice to meet you, Sensei. Wake up and get your butt in gear, Hoshino. Literally, we have to defend the school. Uh, don't they know it's rude to wake the elderly during nap time? Time to teach those helmet gang whippersnappers a lesson. Let's get going. Sensei brought us ammo and supplies to use. Okay, let's sort you, everyone. I'll navigate us from here. Stay on back lines and provide support, Sensei. Sensei! I assume we're gonna have to fix... Uh, yeah, we have, a, we're, we have a fixed one. Interesting. That's a good... That, that, that's a, if, if we have fixed uh, units in storyline, I think that's pretty cool. Uh, it, it provides a lot of ability to experience different units that you didn't roll for. You didn't get during the roll, if, 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 is what I'm saying. Oh, nice. Mm. Angi. Oh, that was not a that was not a good idea. Um. Mm. Yep. Okay, so she's uh she self buffs. Yep, and then and then this is like a big 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 all attack uh with with the drone. Uh. 
Oh, nice. It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a tank. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, I, I'm not kind of, I'm not, I'm not really surprised that, um... Mm, no, it could have been worse. Okay. Why are you hugging your own gun? I mean, it's, I guess it's big enough to hug. So that's fair. No, it is fair. Okay. Um, the Katakata Helmet Gang is retreating from the district. Wow, we won! <laughs> Do you like that, Helmet Gang? Great job, everyone. You're safe to return to campus. Hmm. Being an adult is amazing. Interesting name. That's a very interesting name, I would say. I like how I like the structure of this uh, of this game. Once you get once you get really get into it, I think it's uh, it's easy to get immersed. It's it's not like super complicated. Um, being an adult is amazing. It's, it's not a super complicated story by any means, uh, by any stretch of imagination. But it's it's fun. Being an adult is amazing. Well, I can't believe we won. The Helmet Gang seems pretty seemed pretty determined. Shouldn't say that, Hoshino. Those thugs would have taken over the school had we lost. Sensei gave us the edge we needed to turn the tide. We couldn't have done it otherwise. Experience was likely the deciding factor. It was amazing how you handle resources, equipment, and support. Sheesh, Shiroko. You sound like you have a school goal crush. Anyway, can I go back to sleep now that it's over? You shouldn't tease Shiroko like that, Hoshino. Besides, haven't you slept enough today? Someone got yelled at! <laughs> anyway, we should introduce ourselves, Sensei. We are the Abido's Foreclosure Task Force. I'm Ayane, and I'm a first year in charge of, this, uh, of the Task Force Records and Operations. This is Serika, also a first year. Hey! And these are our second years, Shiroko and Nonomi. Hello, Sensei. We met before. Ignore what Hoshino said, okay? <laughs> and this here is our president. Hoshino is our lone third year. Nice to meet you, Sensei. I'm sure you haven't noticed by how, uh, but by now that our school is in crisis. I'm sure you have noticed that our school by now that our school is in crisis. That's why I reached out to Shale for help, and you've already managed to come through for us. Those thugs would have succeeded in taking over the school if not for you. We can't thank you enough. Ask what the Foreclosure Task Force purpose is. The Foreclosure Task Force goal is to bring Abidos back to its former glory. We're the only club in the school where every single student is a member. I mean, we're the only five students at the school, but still! <laughs> All the others either transferred or dropped out and left town. I don't blame them for leaving Kivitos entirely. With the state that Abidos is in, and now we have to deal with thugs like Katakata Kata Helmet Gang trying to take over the school. It's too difficult to defend Abidos on our own, and embarrassing to see the state it's in, if I'm being honest. We'd have been in real trouble this time if Shale hadn't come around to help us. Seriously, I figured we were done for, once we're out of supplies, not some timing you got had there, there, Sensei. At least we don't have to worry about the helmet gang anymore, it pays to have adults in high places. No, I'm sure it's only a matter of time before they come back. Yeah, probably. Man, I hate them. Who knows how long this will drag out. We have plenty of other things to worry about besides the Helbig Gang. I have a plan? What the? Hoshino came up with a plan? I'm surprised too. I know I'm getting senile in my old age, but you don't have to hurt my feelings. I do my part too, you know. Well, spill it. If history repeats itself, the Helbig Gang will attack again in a few days. So before then, why don't we go on the offensive for once? They'll probably sulk in and vulnerable after that last fight. You mean right now? Yeah, now. With Sensei here, we, may we have more than enough supplies to finish the job once and for all. True. The Helbig Gang's base is 30 kilometers from here. We have plenty of time if we leave now. I'm all for it. The last thing they're expecting is for us to strike now. Can't deny that, but uh, what do you think, Sensei? I'm on board. Great! If Sensei is giving us the green light, then let's hurry up and go! Let's strike while the iron is hot. 
Okay, let's go. Okay, so time to uh, punt the people. We're now on the Katakata Helmet Gangster. I'm detecting their signal within 50 kilometers radius. They must know you're here. Don't let you guard down. Yeah, we're continuing with the uh, with the same team. I figure. I'll go grab water in a moment. In a moment. Mm -hmm. mm, no. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so far so good. Bonk, bonk. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay, let's see. Uh, bonk. Yep. Run. Okay. And we, we healed, uh, and then we go, we go this way to clear the uh, the remaining ones. And then we won. We're done. Yep, we're done. Yeah, I like this. I like this game. Um, it's simple enough to understand easily, but it does seem to have like some so, some a, a bit of wiggle room for for um, for tactics, which is uh, which is good. It's good. I like I like tech. I like being tactical. It's not as see as big of a control as say Path to Nowhere or Ark Knights or whatever the hell. Um, but semi-automatic stuff is always going to be less controllable than anything else. They're retreating. Better yet, the Helmet Gang supplies, hideout, and ammunition were all taken out. But they're, they'll think twice before attacking us again. Great work, everyone. You too, Sensei. Let's head back to the school. Okay. Task Force Predicament. So we, we dealt with the immediate trouble right now, which is the Helmet Gang. Uh, helmet Gang, Helmet Gang. Wonder what is what happens next. Um, can I still continue? Yeah, nice. I can still continue. Cool, cool, cool. Um, how many episodes there are in here? I imagine it will, it's. I imagine the story is pretty long, at this point. Strange days for the task force. Yeah. Um, task force predicament. Let's continue. It's just reading this time around. No fighting. Uh task force predicament. I mean, I, I imagine there's there there really is a lot of stuff to deal with except the uh, helmet gang. The helmet gang was just like an immediate problem that was about to like collapse on them. But it's been dealt with, so it's effectively other things on the table now. Welcome back, everyone. Uh, great work today. We're back. Thanks, Ayane. You too. We finally took down the Katakata Helmet Gang. It should be smooth sailing from here, as if. More like we can finally get to, back to more important matters. <laughs> All we have to focus now on is paying back the debt. Thanks for your help, Sensei. We won't forget what you did for us. Debt? Wait, shoot! Well, the thing is... Stop right there! No, 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 Yana! Why not, Serika? It's not like it's a secret. That doesn't mean we should go telling everybody! Is it th is it, it isn't as though we're guilty or anything. Besides, Sensei is on us now. Hoshino is right, Serika. Sensei is responsible. Trustworthy, even. I know, but they're still an outsider. Not saying Sensei can solve this problem on our behalf, but they're the only adult we have to turn to. Maybe we can come up with a solution if we discuss it with Sensei, even. Or do you have any better ideas, Serika? Well... Sensei just shut up out of nowhere. Why would an adult care about our problems anyway? We're always taking care of ourselves. Why do we suddenly need to be supervised? I don't want any part of this. Serika? I'll go talk to her. I mean, that's kind of understandable after they've been abandoned for so long. It's just like, okay, so this guy just showed up and he's just like, hi, hello. Back to the matter at hand. Our school owes quite a bit of money to a loan company. It's a challenge, but not exactly an uncommon problem either. 
The real issue is that it's over 900 million yen. Okay, it's 962,350,000 yen to be exact. Okay. That's the amount of the bidders. No, that's the amount of the foreclosure tax force has been taken upon itself to pay back. The loan company will foreclose the school and shutter it permanently if we don't repay them. But the odds of paying back a debt that large are practically zero. That's why most of the students left the school in town. All except for us, that is. The debt is the source of everything that's wrong. It's why the school is on the brink of closure, but the students left and why the town is so desolate. Ask about what happened? You mean how the debt was acquired in the first place? There was a sandstorm in the desert surrounding the school several years ago. Sandstorms are common in the Abydos region, but that particular storm was devastating. Some areas were completely buried in sand and they just kept piling up. The school had to raise a lot of funds for disaster relief. But there wasn't a single bank that would give such a large loan. So the school was forced, uh, was forced to turn to loan sharks. Exactly, they were looking to take it the easy way out and pay the money back quickly. But the sandstorms only worsened as the year was on. The years went on. Despite the school's best intentions, the situation just kept getting worse. Today, more than half of Abydos is under sand, and the debt keeps growing. We're barely able to pay the interest every month. We can't even afford ammunition of school supplies. I can sympathize with Sirica's frustrations. No one was ever, uh, has ever cared enough to ask about our situation before, let alone reach out to help. That's the long and short of it. Now that you've helped us scare the Helmet Gang away, we can return and focus on paying off the debt. Even if we appoint you as a club advisor, don't have to trouble yourself with our debt. It was kind of you to listen to our story. We're not trying to pressure you. You've already helped us enough. Hmm. We're in this together now. I won't abandon you. You don't have to say all that. But thank you for doing so anyway, Sensei. Listen to be to you be so noble. You really do go and to insist on helping. I feel so relieved. There's some hope if we have Shale's support. True. Things are looking up at least. Hmm. Hmm. Serika, where are you? She left. The a day in life of Serika. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, we have a combat next one. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go grab water. Um, I'm gonna pause this recording. I'm gonna go grab water. Go grab, grab food because I'm hungry as fuck. Uh, and I'm gonna we're gonna continue on to the next recording. Uh, I'm gonna tell when I'm recording whatever. Else. Um, it's prob I'm gonna probably separate this one into parts. Anyway, we'll see. Um, I'll be back to next recording. Yeah.